Hey guys, these are Boy in a Stripe Pajamas, Chapter 10 Questions, Part 2. Question 6, does Shmuel have many friends? Okay, the answer is no. And a lot of you seem a little bit confused by this, so let's, so let's talk through it. Um, Bruno asks Shmuel, do you have a lot of friends? And Shmuel, that's sort of what he's thinking about, right? Because he wants to make friends. And Shmuel's like, well, kind of. Uh, there are a lot of, uh, there are a lot of boys our age, but they fight a lot. Uh, and that's why I come out here so I can be alone, right? Uh, this tells us a few things. It tells us that there's a lot of people who are living over on uh, the other side. Um, and they're living in kind of, they're living in really bad circumstances. Uh, there are a whole bunch of people crammed into a small space. There's not enough food. There's nothing to do, right? So these these kids just fight all the time, right? You can imagine what the situation must uh, must be like. But they're not Shmuel's friends. That's what Bruno thinks. Um, but he tells him, no, they're not my, that they're not really my friends. And then I want to point this out to you. At the bottom of page 10, Bruno says, it's so unfair. I don't see why I have to be stuck over here on this side of the fence where there's no one to talk to and no one to play with. And you get to have dozens of friends and are probably playing for hours every day. This is what we call irony, right? Uh, when he says it's so unfair, it is unfair, right? It's deeply unfair. It's deeply unfair that Shmuel is in this camp on the other side of the fence, right? Not, not the other way around, like Bruno was thinking about it. He can only understand, oh, you must have all these friends over there and you get to play all the time. He can't understand what is what the, the reality is like on, uh, on the other side. So it's an example of irony. Question seven, what does Bruno say about Germany and how does he feel after he says it? On page 112, because Germany is the greatest of all countries, Bruno replied, remembering something he had overheard father discussing with grandfather on any number of occasions. We're superior. But then he all of a sudden, he immediately feels bad about having said it because I'm going to imagine this is something that he has, he has heard all of his life always from um, from his father, from his grandfather. Germany's superior. Germany's the best country in the world. But when he says it out loud, all of a sudden it sounds um, arrogant, right? It sounds like he thinks that he's better than Schmuel. Um, maybe you can think of things like this. So just stuff, stuff that you sort of hear all the time in your daily life, you just take it for granted. But then when you really start to think about it, maybe it's not actually, actually true. Question eight, what does Bruno discover about out with? The answer here, is that it's in Poland. Uh, Auschwitz, the concentration camp, was in Poland. And this whole time, Bruno has just been thinking that they're in Germany, right? He had no idea that they had gone to uh, to another country. It's important that uh, Bruno does not understand what's happening uh, in the camp. Some of you are seem very quick to like want to get to that. Um, sort of the, the tension, the drama of the novel depends on the fact that Bruno doesn't understand. He looks at it innocently. He looks at it like a child um, without really knowing what he's seeing. Number nine, what does Shmuel say about where he comes from? Shmuel is Polish. He's actually from Poland, but uh, not from that part, right? from a very different part of Poland. On page 112, 114, excuse me, he says, everyone there is very friendly and we have lots of people in our family and the food is a lot better too. It's a, it's, a, it's a much nicer place than uh, the part of Poland that they're in now. And he also says that is, uh, is better than Berlin. It's the best place in the world. This is, this is kids arguing, you know, oh, my house is better than your house. Or no, no, my house is better than your house. Right? Neither of them have even been to where the other one is from. But just because they're young, they just think everything that they know is, uh, is the best.